Let's look at the type of reaction we have here for Mg plus CuCl2. That's magnesium plus copper 2 chloride. So we have this table here. That'll help us. But the first thing is let's write the states in for each one of these compounds. So magnesium is a metal. That's going to be a solid. This copper 2 chloride, CuCl2, it's going to have to be dissolved in water. It's going to have to be aqueous for this reaction to take place. Magnesium chloride, that's also dissolved in water, aqueous. And we know that because chlorides, they're normally soluble. We could also look it up on a solubility table. Copper, that's a metal, so we have a solid. So this is our reaction here. And when we look at it, we can see the magnesium. We start out with this single element here, magnesium, and we end up with a different single element, copper. So we're thinking this is probably going to be a single replacement reaction, also called a single displacement reaction. So think of it this way. The magnesium, that comes in and it pushes the copper out. It replaces it. Here's the copper by itself way over here. So the magnesium, it was by itself, but now it's with the chlorine atoms. And the copper, that was with the chlorines, now it's by itself. So the magnesium replaced the copper. We should be asking ourselves, though, if you think about it, the magnesium replaced the copper. Why doesn't the copper now just replace the magnesium? And to really figure that out, we need to look at a table. This is called the activity series, and it shows us which elements are more reactive. So if you look at the table, here's magnesium. That's up towards the more reactive elements. And then copper, that's less reactive. So magnesium, since it's more reactive, it can push that copper out and then be with the chloride, making the magnesium chloride. The copper, which is less reactive, well, that's left on its own there. So this is the type of reaction. It's a single replacement, sometimes called single displacement reaction, Mg plus CuCl2. Single replacement reaction. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.